Reviewing a plagiarism report can be intimidating and overwhelming. We want to give customers full control over their orders, which means allowing them to get involved in the review and approval of their reports. We created this tutorial video to help explain this process and make your review a straightforward and effortless experience. To start, let's first go over how to read a plagiarism report. The plagiarism report shows the percentage of matches by highlighting unoriginal text along with citations and references. The report will also provide links to matching sources from the web. Matches will always be highlighted in orange, citations in blue, and references in purple. Here is an example of what a citation looks like in the report, as well as a references list. While you may see some words and phrases highlighted as matches, aka words and passages highlighted in orange, this is not necessarily reason for concern. In fact, having a 0% matching score is often as suspicious as a high percentage of matches. Nowadays, it is unavoidable to come across some instances of this, as there are only so many ways to word certain things and present facts. This is especially true when the content of your book is on a specific subject, the instances of using specific descriptors, names of people and places, etc., will typically be flagged as they are common among other writing on the subject and writing in general. Matches can include common phrases, relevant expressions, cliches, and even some passages that may only be able to be properly explained in one way. Nonetheless, you should always review the report in full. Don't rely on a low match score and assume there is no plagiarism. Even a report with a 1% match score could include a plagiarized paragraph or two. Another thing that is important to note is that orders containing recipes will typically have a higher match percentage. This is because recipes are sourced and properly referenced, but our writers cannot change or rewrite too much without the risk of altering the final result. In short, matching text by itself is not an indication of plagiarism. Here are two examples. The text on the left is very obviously plagiarized with long passages being highlighted as matches, while the text on the right has highlighted some similarities but plagiarism is not apparent. To determine if matching text is plagiarism, a human needs to evaluate that the text was copied inappropriately and not cited correctly. After you've reviewed the plagiarism report, our editors will also review them internally as part of their three-pass review process and verify that any matches are in fact only common terms, phrases, and information that cannot be altered. There is no way to produce a 100% original document without having any words or phrases that others use across all the writing that is out there. All in all, we strive to provide original, high-quality content for every customer, and allowing you to review our thorough plagiarism scan is another way to ensure we are exceeding your expectations.